wavy hairs that don't want to stay behind my ears. <laughs> Today is the last day in South Carolina before we go up to see another house in Virginia. Um, and I'm excited because I get to send off a pair of, well it's not a pair, I was going to say a pair of clothes. That doesn't make sense because it's just one clothing item. But that uh, flannel vest back there, I washed it and it's just about dry now. I turned it inside out so it'll be nice and crisp because we got the air on so I'm like, is it damp or is it cold? So I'm leaving it for a little while longer just to make sure. But um, I got that set up and, and I got I got my little thank you card that I get to put in there. Thank you for your purchase, enjoy. And I dried these flowers out a while ago and I didn't really know what to do with them so I've just been putting them in my little thank you note that I stick in there. But um, I get that sent out when Pat gets back from his job. I believe he's doing a garbage disposal today. I do not know. <laughs> but uh, that's the plan for today so far. And I do, I was thinking last night that It's so embarrassing. I want to start doing like a daily weigh-in on here just to give myself accountability but also because I feel like if I was a little bit more consistent in my video posting that more people would tune in. <laughs> but uh, that reminds me, here's your reminder to like and subscribe. Oh, oh I hate saying that. <laughs> But it's true if you don't say it people don't I know half the time I'll be watching a video and I'll be like oh yeah I like it. but I also like to watch a video in its entirety and then decide whether I like it or not because a lot of times I'll watch a video and I'll be starting it like the first five six minutes I'm like awesome great and then something will happen and I'll be like most of the time it's God jokes I don't like God jokes I don't think anybody who loves the Lord likes God jokes <laughs> so, <laughs> but yeah, um, but, um, I'll do a long shot of me stepping on it and then I'll take the camera and step on it again so you guys can see that I'm not lying. <laughs> Yay for embarrassment. Oh, it's gonna be a big one. <laughs> All right, I will do that now and stop procrastinating. Oh, I don't even want to know. I know I put on a few pounds since the last time I checked it because I've been floating between 190 and like 185 the last maybe like six, seven months. My goal is 150. The ultimate goal is 130, but I will be happy at 150. But I know I can feel it in like right here and I can feel it because I have this one pair of pants that is slightly smaller than all the other ones and they're hard to breathe in now. So I know I gained a good bit of weight. It's ice cream's fault. <laughs> I love me some dolce de leche from Hagen da <laughs> Caramel Queen. <laughs> so, but the entire reason I want to lose weight, other than you know health reasons, is because at one point I do want to have a baby. I went to work to win the baby. So like. First of all, being overweight in general is going to leave you with complications giving birth, and I don't want my poor choices to affect that, you know? And believe me, I made a lot of poor choices. <laughs> I made some good ones, too. But the other reason that I want to lose weight in order to have a child is because I want to be able to chase my kid around the playground and play tag and play soccer and all that stuff that an overweight old lady wouldn't be able to do. So that's my main goal is I want to try to lose weight in order to have a baby. But I just want to preface that it's going to be at least two years until I have a baby because I want to A, finally be married, B, be stable in money, and C, have a house for them to grow up in. So once those three are met, then we get <laughs> And in all that time, I gotta lose. Let's give let's let's give myself a little bit of leeway here. Say I still weigh 190, which I know I don't. To get to 150, that's 40 pounds. That's not a lot. I feel like I could do that. 
but the reality is I'm probably closer to 200. So that's still just 60, no, 50 pounds. I can do math, you know? So I've been trying a lot lately. What I do is when I get up in the morning, I have water and I have black coffee because there's no calories in this bad boy until you put stuff in it. <laughs> so I try to at least if I wake up real, real early in the morning, excuse me for the burp, if I wake up really early in the morning, then I'll wait till like 11 to try to eat something and it'll usually just be eggs or toast. Or if we have bagels, I'll have a bagel or cream cheese. But um, I love carbs. <laughs> carbs and caramel. See, see. Um, but if I wake up a little later, like I did today, it was 9.30, I'll probably wait until like one or two to actually eat something. Um, and then again, I'll probably just do eggs or toast or we don't have bagels now, but I love bagels. Um, so, you know, but I haven't decided yet if I want to both just do like a little weigh in in the mornings or if I want to show you guys what I eat all day. Maybe I'll do that sometimes, some not times. Um, grammar, not sometimes, not some not times. <laughs> But yeah, that's the plan because I know if I'm doing that and I'm a little bit more accountable and I'm showing the world, woo, then um, then hopefully I'll actually lose the weight because I don't I don't want to have a I was mad that's why I didn't record anything right afterwards but I knew it was coming so I shouldn't have been mad but I still was <laughs> um, for breakfast today I had a plum which wasn't a lot but still um, for lunch I had a burrito it was pre-made it was 260 calories not the best thing not the worst and for dinner, I cooked up some chicken breast in olive oil and some Italian seasonings, some garlic, and I had french fries on the side, and I made him pierogies. So, not the most wonderful meals today, but also not the worst. Um, I've, I've just been drinking lemon water and coffee today, so I'm not drinking my calories at least. But yeah, 196.2. <laughs> it's alright, it's a starting point, but um, I'm excited to be held accountable and just to feel better. So thanks for hanging out with me today, thanks for joining me on this journey, and I look forward to hanging out with you again tomorrow.